Today I am going to talk about a strategy which can help to solve some challenging math problems. Make a list. This involves making an organized list by using the data given. This strategy allows students to clearly examine the data and draw a conclusion from it. It is easier to examine a list of organized data than looking at the unstructured data. They can discover the pattern in the data and use them to solve the problems. Finding and understanding patterns is important factors that contribute to mathematical problem solving. It is easier for students to understand the patterns if they know how to structure or organize the data. Once the data is organized, it can be processed at much ease and turn out to be a valuable database for translating meaningful information. Many students find it helpful if the data is well organized. This process requires or enables them to think more deeply about each piece of data given and to think about how those pieces fit together. Let's do a simple example of a word problem that can use the make a list method. There are three cars which are red, blue and green. They are going for a race. How many different ways could they finish? For the first way, let the first car be red. The second car be the blue and third one be the green one. Is there any way we can put the red card first? Yes, we can swap the blue and green cars. The second card be the green and third one is the blue one. So is there any way we can put the red card first? No, we can put the blue card first now this time. Let second card be the red and third one is the green one. For the fourth way, we can make a swap between the red card and the green card. The green card will be second and third will be the red one. So is there any way we can put the blue card first? No. We can put the green card first now this time as red card and blue card have already been first in the previous ways. Let second card be the red and third one is the blue one. For the sixth way, we can make a swap between the red card and the blue card. The blue card will be second and third will be the red one. Is there other way now? No. There are a total of six different ways for the outcome. Look at the setting out of the list. Reinforcing the point that if students are systematic, they will have a list of all possibilities and avoid duplication. That's all for now. Remember to subscribe our channel. See you again.